What's happening, people? Paddy the Baddy Pimler here, flossing my scramble gear as I do, sponsored athlete, you know. I'm just gonna show you a few tutorials today on uh, how to take the back, control the back from all different positions. Do what you want from me, you know, you know me, I take backs and choke people, that's how we do. I've got my ugly assistant here, my good pal, Adam Venti, yeah. So, let's get started. We're going to start in mount, yeah. What we're going to do, Adam's always going to be defending. He's not going to let you get anything. He knows that here you're going to be going for stuff like arm bars and mounts, all sorts of stuff like that. So what he's going to do, he'll be pinning his arms together, staying in tight. So what you want to do is you want to isolate one of them. So we'll control one arm and we'll pin that to the mat here. What this then does, it has this arm strap, so you can start doing stuff with this arm if you want, but what we really want him to do, we want to trick him. So we make him think that we're going to do something to this arm. So now he turns, rolls over and he'll grab his hands together. So now we can't isolate this arm, we can't do something to it on its own. Now Adam's got the defence here, but what he doesn't know, I've done that on purpose to take the move off him. So all I'm going to do here, he's joined his hands together. My hand will come round the back, my left hand, and control his right hand. I'll pull it in tight, and I'll take the huge daddy position here. So when you do it, you can let go of the arm that you had hold of originally, yeah? All you need to do is pull the other arm tight, and look, Adam can't get out, trying his hardest to get out. I'm pulling that wrist tight, a little bit, bit of a choke, and it's making his face turn towards the floor. I'll then put my hand on his elbow, and push him down that way. And now what I do, see this foot? What's behind him on his back? This knee will go into his back there as much as it can. And then look as I roll towards my left shoulder, same arm what's got hold of his hand around his head in the who's your daddy position. I'll roll towards that shoulder and pull him on top of me here. And what I like to do is I like to keep this across his face as much as we can here. And then look now when Adam pulls his arm away, that arm can slip in nice and easy and you can get your proper choke. Go body triangle if you want to, yeah? So, show you it from the other side down, so you can see it both ways. We're gonna make him think we're gonna go for stuff, make him think we're gonna go for arm bars, or stuff like that, Camoras, Americanas. We're gonna control his arm, pin it to the mat. Adam's gonna turn over. Thinking that I'm gonna go and go for an arm lock on him. Adam's gonna roll over onto his side and then gonna go chest down, weight on his shoulder, arm comes round the back of his head, and I can throw his arm, hold it, who's your daddy in tight. Don't let him move, yeah. See if there's a gap here like this, Adam will just get out. Yeah. When you do it, hold this wrist tight. If you don't do that, you'll just get out. And then push down on his elbow as well to turn his face more to the floor. Dig my knee into his back as much as I can, and then I'll roll towards my shoulder, come over, and see here where Adam's still got his arm strapped. He's thinking, oh, I want to get my arm out, I want to get my arm out as he pulls it out, pulls it out. You slide the other arm underneath, and he'll lock you, rear naked choke up. So, hope you've enjoyed that tutorial. Hope you start using it, take it into your BJJ school, start smoking bitches with it, yeah? Get onto the Warrior Collective and get more videos like this. If you just want to find out more about me, get on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, at Paddy the Baddy, let me know. And of course, if you just want some state-of-the-art revolutionary jiu-jitsu gear, get on Scramble, you just know where they are.